Lesson 177. Review of the Lessons 163 and 164. Hi there. Ready to explore the next two ideas from the fifth review period of our Course in Miracles video series? Here's what we will be reviewing today for Lesson 177. Lesson 163. There is no death. The Son of God is free. Lesson 164. Now are we one with Him who is our source. Remember, each lesson from this review period stems from this central theme. God is but love, and therefore so am I. With that in mind, let's revisit the two ideas of today's lesson. God is but love, and therefore so am I. There is no death. The Son of God is free. God is but love, and therefore so am I. Now are we one with Him who is our source. God is but love, and therefore so am I. Now, let's turn this into a brief yet powerful meditation. But always remember, words are mere tools. They facilitate our practice, but our faith should be rooted not in the words, but in the experience stemming from our practice, and in the state of mind that we're striving to achieve. Ready to begin? Take a big, deep breath. Close your eyes and journey inward. Invite the Holy Spirit to come into your consciousness, to guide you in this meditation, and to guide your thoughts for the rest of the day. Look past your everyday thoughts and dive deeper, into your other mind, the one that is one with God. Right here, right now, softly repeat to yourself. God is but love, and therefore so am I. Offer your practice to God and listen for His Word. He is with you. Should you stumble, He will help you stand again. If you lose your path, He will remind you of the right way. If you wander, He will call you back home. God is but love, and therefore so am I. There is no death. The Son of God is free. God is but love, and therefore so am I. Now are we one with Him who is our source. God is but love, and therefore so am I. Remember, you are not alone on this journey. The Holy Spirit, your internal teacher, your holy inner self, Jesus, however you want to call Him, walks with you. He speaks to you, reviewing these thoughts along with you. God is but love, and therefore so am I. There is no death. The Son of God is free. God is but love, and therefore so am I. Now are we one with Him who is our source. God is but love, and therefore so am I. You are His voice, His eyes, His feet, His hands. You are His vessel to bring salvation to the world. His self is truly yourself. Reach out to your brother, for this is a journey we do not walk alone. In your brother, God walks with you, and you walk with God. Our Father wishes His Son to be one with Him. God is but love, and therefore so am I. And that wraps up today's lesson. Remember to start and end your day with the core idea of this review period. God is but love, and therefore so am I. And don't forget to keep practicing as we just did throughout the day, at every waking hour. God is but love, and therefore so am I. With today's review, we are reminded that death is an illusion, and that we do not truly die when our physical body dies. Whenever we identify with our body, we may find ourselves under the effects of our fear of physical death. Yet, when we identify with our spirit, we start to realize that we do not end when our physical body dies. We are eternal, as God is eternal, and as the Son of God is. However, 
we are also reminded that the illusion of death manifests in many forms, such as fear, anger, and doubt. These are all thoughts contrary to the eternal life God has given us. We are encouraged to reject these illusions and embrace the truth of our divine eternal nature. Death cannot touch the Son of God. Let's align with God's will and affirm that life is the only reality, so we can dispel the fear of death and embrace our oneness with God's eternal love. And let's remember that recognizing our oneness with God can only be done in the present moment. By letting go of illusions and judgment, we aim to experience that state of mind that we are taught to call the Christ's vision, a shift in perception that will reveal a new world in a new light, full of innocence and holiness. Our goal goes beyond intellectual understanding, as intellectual understanding can only take us so far. Instead, we aim to enter into a transformative experience, an experience where we can hear heaven's call and feel Christ's presence, where we realize our oneness with our Source, and where we can bring healing and salvation, not just for ourselves but for the entire world. Lesson 163 There is no death. The Son of God is free. Lesson 164 Now are we one with Him who is our source. You're doing an incredible job. Be proud of the progress you've made. So keep up the great work, and remember, we're all on this journey together. See you tomorrow for another review lesson. Quick note before you go. Making these videos is a labor of love but it's still financially challenging. If you've found value in what you've watched, please consider supporting with a donation. Even the humblest contribution means the world and ensures the continuation of these daily lessons. Thank you for your generosity. Did you enjoy the video and find it helpful? Please give it a like and leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. We have a new lesson every day. And if you've been with us for a while, please consider supporting the channel. There's a lot of love behind these videos. Check out the video description for more details.